a woman. Hmm. She married a rag doll. Oh, okay. Well, uh, this is the so and again. Now, now it, she. Now I do. I just. Have, I just want to. Mm. So everyone's like, "Oh, rag doll. That's sweet." Like that song from Aerosmith. Rag doll. Rag doll. I think it's about a child prostitute. It is very well possible, which is exactly what Steven Tyler looks like now. <laughs> Woman who made rag doll has made a baby rag doll. Uh, now she's calling that her child. Mm. And if you take a look at the rag doll. It actually kind of looks like Woody Allen in the most recent interview with Alec Baldwin, which I want to say, thank you, Alec Baldwin. Well-timed. Perfectly timed interview just when the nation... Needed it. I'm so What's thankful. What's Woody thinking? The whole What's time, Woody thinking? This whole, this whole week, I was like, what is Woody Allen thinking? What's think? Woody thinking? He, he marries these children. <laughs> you know what <laughs> yes. I mean? Think about that, how happy he must be. Oh, good Lord. But the thing about... <laughs> he really this fucking, does. This ragdoll woman, right? Yeah. So her name is Myri. Maravone Rocha Morais. Uh, sure. We found this. This is definitely a real article. This is definitely not fake. But she, um, the one thing I'll say about the ragdoll baby, looks just like the father. It really does. Absolutely um, beautiful. She says she fell in love and then fell pregnant mm. uh, and even claimed that she put on four pounds during the ragdoll pregnancy. I don't which, think she needs to claim that. I think that she purposely did that. Well, I think that's kind of fun. And yeah, that's sure. One, that's one great thing. You gotta eat. You get to eat quite a bit. So not wanting to give birth out of wedlock, she did arrange for a wedding to be in well, front of 250 family and friends. Let's set this up. Folks. Yes. First of all, also, she took him into the pool. Um, you can see right here, it's absolutely soaking <laughs> wet. And uh, hopefully some pictures will go up on the Patreon so you can really see what the hell what it is that we're talking here. So It's a good looking ragdoll. Yeah, I'm so broken. Uh, so this woman, Mervion, she said, um, to be honest, uh, she always wanted a man. Sure. She always was. She was sad. She said the biggest problem she had is that she used to go out to the Faro dancing nights. Oh, that's um, fun. Which is F O R R O apostrophe. I don't know what the kind of dancing it is. And she would always get so sad. Why? And she would go to the dances and she'd never have a partner. And oh. she'd say she'd see the other girls faroing with the other real men. The, mm. I mean, actual human men. And she was like, "Oh, I wish that I could." And so what she did was, and her mother. This actually came from the doll was actually put together by her mother. Well, uh, I have and to say, the doll looks like if you're a firefighter and you're going through the training exercises and you have to carry a cadaver up and down a whole series of stairs, that's kind of what the doll looks like. She could have gotten one of the real dolls that has a With penis, a nuts, and a face. Nuts and a yeah, face. Yeah, something you but can touch. I do like the organic nature of this make-believe husband of hers. I don't. The, the, the husband's name is Marcello. Yes. And if you, again, it is just a body pillow with the head uh, sewn onto it. And the woman, again, she says, the wedding was a wonderful day for me. Very important. Very emotional. Very emotional. It rained a lot. Mm. But it was wonderful. Well, you don't want to get it um, all. You don't want to get your rag doll husband all wet. But so yes, yeah, especially so they, when he's wearing his finest rag doll suit that uh, I'm sure he did not have to get. From destination extra large. He's account. made out of fleece. He has no feet. Um, but the man, uh, so she, the, her mother, made this ragdoll boyfriend for her. So I guess so she could then she then would take it to the dance nights. I don't know whether or not Marivion has a full brain. We like don't, I don't know we, if it's true or not. I don't know if she lost some. I don't know if she's had a, an injury. Well, who knows? I mean, no matter what, she's very happy, and she does have a lot of family and friends. This wedding is larger than your wedding, than Marcus's it's wedding. It's much bigger than my wedding. 250 people is yes. absolutely insane. It's a huge and wedding. And I'm sure, unlike Holden's wedding, they actually got to eat all the food before the mother involved decided to cut everybody off. They actually went to fucking Rio de Janeiro for they their had, honeymoon. They had the sweetest wedding of all of our oh, friends. Better than all of our friends. they had a honeymoon that was better than all of our friends. Yes. So, Next time you're speaking with your wife and, and she's mad and you're mad at her, you can say I'm well, slightly worse than the ragdoll husband. I'm slightly worse. I could wish I was half the husband that Marcelo, the fuckable body pillow, was. <laughs> I don't even think he's um, fuckable because he has no penis. So they got together and she said, that, like, again, she says he has so many great qualities, but the only downside is he is lazy. Oh. He doesn't work at all. Huh. But I am a warrior. And I keep it going for us. Do you remember that movie, way underrated, called May? Oh, yes. The woman, she made her own best friend. I actually don't even consider that underrated. I think that's pretty fairly rated. It just okay. has, it's underseen. Underseen, perhaps. I love it that is. film. But the question is at what point does this creature become sentient? At what point does this rag you doll really end on up? I am, I am on it because really the AI is sentient. Uh, what, what point does it wake up and kill this poor, lonely uh woman? 
literally only if her wishes come true. Exactly. That is what she wishes it could do. Because that's what she said. You know, it's true. Marcelo, he then did get me pregnant. He didn't take care of himself. <laughs> and he didn't use a condom. Oh. And she said again, it's on you too, guys. It's on you too. It's, get a vasectomy. I, I, if you can, Fucking get it snippety done. snippity-step, right? She Vaxed said, out. he got me pregnant. I took the test. It was positive. It was positive. I couldn't believe it because he's a rag doll. Not real. No penis. Never once had sex with me. I'm just happy that everyone's going along with it. Oh, they, the they have no choice because if not, she's going to kill everybody. I watched half of that movie. Actually, like six months ago, Lars and the Real Girl. Oh, yeah. It's uh, kind of unwatchable. I don't know why. It's, it's, it's horrifying. Yes, yeah. It's well, because they try to make it but, normal, but it's not. Like, they try to make it cute, but at the same time, all I see is every story we've ever covered on side stories. So I do understand, like, on some level, it was a kind of like a fun, quirky idea with Ryan right. Gosling with the sex doll that he married him. But we have probably, this is probably the 20th story we've yeah. covered in the history of side stories of people this level of broken it was the other blonde white attractive actor i think that was in the movie what i don't think it was ryan gosling i think it was uh i know for a fact i'm right dumb fuck shit head uh what i mean no, i think that's what his name's in swedish no, it's uh it's uh it's that other dude it's ryan gosling crushed it all i do is fucking crush it ryan all i do Ga and so there, she's she's a porn star with a pun on ryan gosling oh i'm certain there must be everybody's sucking each other's dick fantastic i didn't feel the contradiction i didn't feel the contractions in pain seeing the placenta and the umbilical cord and the blood is what made it real for me so i'm just so happy they want her to be happy and everyone is going along with it she, now, he was here 35 minutes and he is great. It really upsets me when people say that he is fake. It makes me so angry. At this point, I'm not I'm not convinced he is fake. I, I am a she, woman of character. My father, yeah. my mother taught me to be honest, to be a good person. I know. And I want to take advantage of anything. I know. And I'm actually very proud of you for not taking advantage of a man and killing him and stuff. She did. Oh, she did. Actually, now I'm starting to feel bad for Marcelo because it sounds like she just wanted that fucking baby anyway. Marcelo's fucking trapped. He doesn't even know. He has a working he, man's mustache. He's way overwhelmed. He's She trapped Go him. Go to work. Every day he's just getting screamed at. And he's like, I'm made of straw. So please, God, leave me alone. Um, but these guys vote. You know what I mean? The, this this well, this this, one, Europe, this is in I you. I think yeah. I think this is might be in Suda America. I'm not certain, mm, but yeah. whatever. Just know that they're not alone. They're not just there. They're here too. They're everywhere. People I'm, that that marry their toilets. They are there. They're and they're viable. They're running for the House of Representatives. Yeah, marry we the toilet. really we need to need to take a close look. I'd we need to take a close close look at this take issue. A close look. I'd marry the microwave. You always know what time it is. And also, you're on there. <laughs> Pretty hot. Um, either way, this rag doll is only four pounds. And, uh, you know, or she gained four pounds. There's so many people at this wedding. pregnancy. And, uh, oh, it was in Rio de, de Janeiro. Oh, well, I think that's where that got to it. It was just the idea that, like, because then she also has to make him fuck her. You know what I mean? Right? Uh, yes, but she has to probably put some kind of strap on, on him because, again, he well, is Also, dickless. remember, I just want to reiterate... The baby's also a rag doll. Baby's the a rag baby doll. doll's a rag doll. So it's not. I'm That's just how saying, you know it's his. Yes. <laughs> yes. If yes. it you wasn't, if, it, if it, it wasn't a rag doll, Marcellus oh, then, would be like, um, "Who the fuck is that? Uh, Don't look would, like my baby." But he would have been. He'd have said it with his eyes. Yeah. Um. But yeah, it's it. Yeah. So just to remember that again. Yeah, the baby itself was also a rag doll made definitely by her mother. Yes. Because it's somebody. It's made out of the same material. Thank God. Absolutely. Well, I'm just happy again. Her mother knows just how lonely and sad her daughter is, and she's not pussyfooting around. No. She's not saying maybe she'll find someone. She said, no, you know what? I'll I'm do making it. Her, I'm making her a man. And that's what it's all about. And I think that's what 2023 needs to be all about, especially is action. Is if Absolutely. you go out there and you see something that needs to be done, don't wait for somebody else to come and do it. It's time for you to do it. If you see that your neighbor's fucking a stump in his backyard, make him a woman out of a bunch of garbage. We'll drill a hole in the stump for and him, And then maybe. go like, hey... This is so you could help get Al Franken the nomination. There you go. I mean, just get him, but move him, move him towards it. Barbara, the bag of leaves, have fun with her, and then at the end of the day, when you fake kill her, because obviously you're a psychopath, very much. She just turns into mulch, and then she grows into a beautiful tree. That's, and, I, and I feel though, at the same time though, can I say that that is a bad example? Yeah. Because only because sure. then you start to create that positive feedback loop. Every single time I kill, I'm helping the environment. Yeah, but if you are killing a series of bag of leaves. I think it will be fine. Sometimes, by the way, if your children are playing in leaves, don't run over them. 
Because I hear stories about that every uh, every fall. What? There's always kids playing in leaves, and their dad runs over them with the car. I mean, I it don't happens know. It's every fall. It just sounds like natural selection. Yeah.